So the new B-Dog ski, the formula stays the same. If it ain't broke, you don't fix it. And in this case, it's working so well that we ain't got to touch it. It enables me to do whatever I envision doing. As far as the top sheet, we worked with uh, the same artists as we did the previous year with the black. We aim to showcase, showcase the cartoon look that I've been producing. So it's uh, JP represented as the canary who's flying away and uh, B-Dog salutes him and thanks him because JP put me on Armada, put me on the scene, lifted me up. I thought it was a great time to illustrate it and finally have him on a ski in a way that's uh, subtle but yet revealing. I've been skiing a lot on the B-Dog because I think it's just, it's so soft and like you can play around in so many different ways and it's super, super playful. I love the B-Dogs too, I gotta say, like I got to spend a lot of time on the B-Dogs, skied all types of terrain with the B-Dogs and that was like eye-opening too, having that soft of a ski, so bouncing back and forth a little bit between the B-Dog and Idolo is perfect combinations. It's like the driver and the putt for a golf man, you gotta have them both. Honored and humbled that people are using it. Also, a lot of credit is due to Henrik, such a top tier skier, and he can make anything look seamless and also do incredible tricks off ski. So, anytime someone sees him on that, they're like, oh, you can do nose butter triple on that ski. I didn't know. Bill ain't doing it, but Henrik's doing it. So, he definitely put me on, and I owe him a big thanks for it. If you're looking for a ski that will support you when you're popping and also enable you to get a good bounce, press, and have an all around good support for carving, being on the mountain on any type of uh, day, whether it be icy to groomed to slushy, you're gonna float and master the slopes. So, Consider taking a pair of B-Dogs and treating yourself. <laughs>